All right, welcome back to Combat in Progress, UHC, I think, yeah. Um, where um, we play UHC in the newest combat update, which is um, to Combat Test 8C, it says on the screen, so I'm just going to go with that. Um, and it's uh, all new. Well, not all new. It's a, it's a bit of a combination of... Uh, of of you of uh, old and new combat. Anyway, uh, I was talking about movies in the last episode, and I think I'm just going to continue with that because it was fun. Uh, <laughs> I was talking about the Batman movies and how I've been rewatching them, um, and we were on to Batman Returns, which was like which was in my opinion a better movie than the first one, um, because of Danny DeVito playing the Penguin was just really great, and I think the other actors did great as well. Uh, except, um, I was, uh, yeah, I was talking about Catwoman, and I didn't like the portrayal of Catwoman in this specific, specific, uh, specific instant installation of the uh, of the story. Um, and I don't think that's in, that's at fault of the actress who played her, because I think the actress actually did a good job of playing that woman. Um, but um, in this case, uh, I feel like in this in, in, in this in, in this instance of the story, Catwoman is not like her. T uh, it, it, it's she is a um, actually just a normal woman right and uh she gets thrown out of a window <laughs> and then she suddenly becomes scatwoman which yeah it doesn't just that just doesn't oh there goes andronicus uh, it just doesn't make sense to me um and in other instances of the story she is like this very way way cooler personality <laughs> um and um and she leans into the, 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 the monster burglar role way more, and I think I like that way better than uh, than this this version of her. But uh, that that comes down to personal preference, really. I think um, I just like I just like her being like on the edge of bad and good, uh, playing with Batman, and she, she was a bit more on the bad side i feel like on the in this movie which is fine because she does that sometimes she is bad sometimes she is good that that's her whole her whole shtick but um she didn't have a special connection with batman and she way more had um just like she was manipulating to batman obviously but she was also manipulating to like all the other men which is yeah part of her story but like part of her part of her thing, she she's a woman and that manipulates man. Um, to do for to get them to do what she wants. That's a lot of the uh, woman villain ropes. I hear I keep hearing footsteps, but I think it's just a zombie. Um So yeah, I don't know. So that, she didn't, didn't have that connection with Batman as far as I'm, I'm concerned. Oh! So, yeah. Might just be my opinion, but... I thought she was better portrayed in other, in other medias. It might also be a creeper. I got enough for a bow. Oh! Clarts is suffocated in a wall? That's a lot of spiders. I think that might be a cave spider spawner.
Um, I hope that's not the, 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 the world border. Anyway, uh, other things I was going to talk about. Not going towards the spiders, obviously. Oh, gold. Um, sorry, I was kind of brought out of it by the death of Clark, so I was <laughs> hoping it wasn't the world border. And luckily it wasn't. Um, anyway, movies. Uh, the next one is Batman Forever. Now, I think I had seen Batman for No, I hadn't seen Batman Forever yet, which is the one with Two-Face and the Riddler. Um, and... Um, I really enjoyed it, actually. <laughs> it was a, that was, a, in my opinion, was a really good movie. Uh, well, not really, really good, but it was it was quite decent. Might be my favorite of the f of the ones I've talked about so far. Uh, but that's just because the, I'm a really big fan of the Riddler as a villain, um, and I love how unhinged um, uh, the actor played him. I I'm really bad at actor names. Um, Jim Carrey. I love how unhinged Jim Carrey played him. Uh, like, unhinged and flamboyant, I'd say. Um, which, he almost took to the extreme so much that it was just on the edge. Like, if he had done it any more or any worse, I wouldn't have liked it as much, uh, <laughs> but I, th I think it was decently handled. There were a couple of points where I think it didn't fit or it was a little bit cringy, maybe even. Um, but uh, for the rest, I really liked how Jim Carrey played uh, the Riddler, and uh, definitely, like I said, by far my favorite. Uh, favorite Batman villain in general. Um, I don't know the actor's name for Two Face. Um, I'm pretty bad. Uh, <laughs> Uh, but I think Two Face in that portrayal portrayal um, was was also uh, they, they they played together well. The he was also definitely crazy, and I feel like almost um, Two Face in this version was a lot like the Joker would be uh, normally, but um, he definitely played a different kind of. Crazy uh, than Jack Nicholson did. Uh, so I think it was actually fine. Um, oh, there's a skeleton down there. Yeah, I'm not gonna go here. It's too open. So uh, I think it was fine. There were uh, obviously a new actor for Batman, which I think was a, he was a little better than Keaton. Um, and. Um, they also got Robin, um, which I think was Robin was the the the, the Robin, the first Robin. Uh, he was really good as the first Robin. Uh, like he was definitely spunky and like winning, winning to become Robin, 
uh, but not for the not per se for the right reasons, but still willing to do good, you know. And of course, Batman has to be um, n not winning at first, and uh, I think they played off together well. Um, and then after Batman Forever uh, is um, Batman and Robin. Oh, a little lag there. Oh no. Uh, it was Batman and Robin, which I had seen before, actually. One of the few ones that I had seen before was Batman and Robin. Um, which often is seen as a bad installation in the series. Um, it's the one with uh, Mr. Freeze. And uh, Poison Ivy. Um... And a lot of people seem to think, and, and with George Clooney as Batman, um, and a lot of people seem to think it's bad. And yeah, at certain points, it's not the best. I don't know if I like Arnold Schwarzenegger as Mr. Freeze. <laughs> That's definitely a choice. Um, <laughs> um, I'm not really behind that. I like Poison Ivy, she was done very well, I think. He's gonna fall. He's gonna fall. Hey, I'm Iron Man, really. stuff down there. I know it's down, but that ravine was not looking like I could safely explore it at all. Alright, what's next? Next is Batman Begins, and Batman Begins obviously is a uh, start of a whole new series of Batman movies actually, I'd say. Um, whole new Batman, whole new, well not storyline, I, I, I think. It's, it, it, it's the origin. Oh, love for Slay Majaro, there goes finally. Hope that any kills. I could, could kill Jarrod, but yeah. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah. Spiders. Um, and Batman Begins is uh, definitely an alright movie. I really like the Scarecrow as well as a, as a, as a villain, so uh, it was alright. Um, I'm 
believe me, believe it or not, a lot of people like Ra's al Ghul. I, not, I mean, I, I definitely think Liam Neeson is the right guy to play Ra's al Ghul, but I am. Um, I, I'm not a big fan of the character Ra's al Ghul, so um, I'm never really gonna like him, I guess. But. Uh, I mean, it's the origin story of Batman, so I guess <laughs> it's not bad in any means. I just not not my not my Batman movie, I'd say. Um, put all that bad stuff down there. Oh, there's a case spider in there now as well. No thanks. Uh, and now I'm currently watching The Dark Knight Rises, which is obviously a masterpiece of a movie. Um, but I haven't seen it. Oh, fuck. Oh, there goes that. Didn't really have to keep it anymore. Ow. Well, doesn't mean I just should give up. Hi, are you gonna come over here or? I'm just gonna dig because this match after is not really doing me any favors. Oh. Look at all the shit down there. Why is there so much mob? Though? So many mobs. Minecraft really doesn't share its mob rates, does it? You get all of them or you get none of them. I just drew the short out of the sick, I suppose. Either the mindset was just too way too high up, I suppose. Hi. I don't know why I just grabbed that coal over there. That's why you say fair, but oh well. I don't have enough gold for a golden apple yet. I thought I had enough. I 
I shouldn't waste my arrows. Looking at health, you think I'd be doing okay-ish, at least. But uh, the others all have healing, I don't. <laughs> Most likely. I'm gonna dig again. A firm is better health as well. Uh, Rocket is on the same health. As well as Foster and Brody, so. They would all kill me easily. Episode's over. Okay, well, guys, see you guys next time. Bye-bye.